How can God be one and three? It doesn't make logical sense, and yet Scripture affirms its truth. We see that here, that that Jesus had glory with the Father before the world existed. For all of eternity, Jesus is one with the Father and glorifies the Father, has the glory of the Father, gives glory to the Father. And this isn't just Jesus, but if you look back in chapter 16 when he's teaching the disciples, he talks about the Spirit in the same language. So you see this, this relationship that happens within these members of the Trinity. That God is one. There is one God. And yet, there's three. There's the Spirit. There's the Son. There's the Father. John's Gospel shows us that Jesus is fully God. All throughout John's Gospel, it shows us that Jesus is fully God. That the Spirit is fully God. That they're one with the Father in this community. 